Community Clothing Assistance, Referral Database System, C-Card System. What is C-Card System? C-Card System, Community Clothing Assistance, Referral Database System. The C-Card is a database system used to store and keep track of community partners and customers who are referred to CCA by its over 100 partner agencies under its flagship referral program. The program creeps record of the customers and its past services. Furthermore, 1. Saves time and resources. 2. Improves service speed. 3. More accurate. 4. Provides data for statistical analysis. 5. Integration of social organizations. How it works. The client visits the partner agency. CCA partner logs in and creates a referral. Client picks free clothing from CCA. Clients register only once and receive ID CCA card, which will be presented at the next service time if needed. The client is served. An email is sent to the community referral partner informing about the service. Applying online for community partnership. An organization or agency which wants to refer clients to CCA for free clothing must first become a partner by filling in the online application found on www.communityclothingassistance.com. For now, you can access the system at 184.70.50.126. On C-Card homepage, click on the Join Us button, second from the right on the top navigation bar. This will take you to the online application form. Applying online for partnership. Here, the applicant agency needs to fill out the details about their organization, like the name, address, contact, etc. Applying online for partnership. Details of the organization's staff who will act as the primary contact between the partner organization and CCA is required. The primary contact will act as the administrator for the partner agency. Primary contact has more access control than referral agent, will be the person whose details are submitted in the online application. Applying online for partnership. Organization, mission, and executive director information. The name and contact details of the executive director of the organization is required, followed by a brief description of the organization, like their field of work and their activities. Once the details are filled in, please click the Submit button. Applying online for partnership. Application preview. Once the Submit button is clicked, the system will show you a preview of the details that you entered. After checking the details, click on the Confirm button to submit the application. Applying online for partnership. To take a printout of your filled in details, Click on the Print button. To go back and edit the application, click on the Edit button. Applying online for partnership. Congrats on successfully submitting your partnership application to Community Clothing Assistance. Application Approval. Once an application is submitted, it will appear on the dashboard of the Administrator of Community Clothing Assistance. Applying online for partnership. Application Approval. Once an application has been approved, a user account with a default password will be created for the primary contact whose details were filled in on the online application. The email ID of the primary contact will be used as username. An email with the status of the application and login details of the primary contact will be sent to the email address of the primary contact. Once the primary contact is logged into the system, he or she can change their password and also create user accounts for other staff of the organization who will be referring clients to community clothing assistance. Applying online for partnership. Creating worker referral agent profiles. Only the authorized referee of the partner agency who can access C-Card system can refer customers to CCA. Please do not authorize your volunteers as a referral agent. The worker profile can be created only by the user administrator, who is the primary contact of the organization 
with CCA. The user administrator has control over only those workers' accounts belonging to his or her organization. Applying online for partnership. Creating worker profiles. To create a worker profile, first log into your account on the C-Card system. Then click on the Referee Partner Profiles button on the left pane. From the drop-down list, select Create Referee Partner Profile option. Then the Create Worker Profile form appears in the middle pane of the page. After entering the details, Click on the Create button and the worker profile is created. Username, email ID, password, password. View and update worker profile. To view or update the worker profile, click on the Referee Partner Profiles button on the left pane. Then, select the View Referee Partner Profile option from the drop-down list. This will display a list of workers from the organization of the user. This feature is available only for user admins. View and update worker profile. Enter the worker's ID into the search box and click on the view button. The worker's profile will be displayed. Click on the edit button and then make the necessary changes and then click on the update button. Servicing customers. One, the customer approaches a partner agency. Two, Agency creates customer profile only once in the C-Card system after verifying his or her ID. If the ID is not available, then please insert the best information. 3. Once a customer profile is created, the authorized worker gives the customer a printed stub with his user ID, which needs to be presented at CCA. This is to be done only the first time. 4. Then the customer visits the CCA Center and presents the same ID. CCA staff verifies the details and creates CCA customer ID card for further services. The card is handed over to the customer after he signs a Policies and Terms document. Servicing Customers Creating Customer Profile Only once. First, click on the Customer Profiles button on the left pane. Then, a drop-down list will appear with four options. From the list, select Create Customer Profile option. The Create Customer Profile form will appear in the middle of the page. Servicing Customers View and Update Customer Profile To view the Customer Profile first, click on the Customer Profiles button on the left pane. Then, from the drop-down list, which appears, select the View Customer Profile. The Customer Profiles list will appear in the middle of the web page. Servicing Customers To search for a customer, type the customer's name in the search box at the top right corner of the table and the customer record will be displayed at the top. To view a customer's profile, enter the customer's CCA customer ID in the search box below the search customer profile caption as shown in the figure. Then, click on the View button and the customer profile is displayed. To update the profile, Click on the Edit button and make the changes, and then click the Submit button. Servicing Customers Create Child Profile First, click on the Customer Profiles button on the left pane. Then, a drop-down list will appear with four options. From the list, select Create Child Profile option. The Create Child Profile form will appear in the middle of the page. Servicing Customers View and Update Child Profile Click on the Customer Profiles button on the left pane. Then, from the drop-down list which appears, select the View Child Profile. The Child Profiles list will appear in the middle of the web page. Here, a list of all the child customers will be displayed. Servicing Customers To search for a child, the child's name in the search box at the top right corner of the table and the corresponding child customer record will be displayed at the top. To view a child customer's profile, enter the child customer's CCA child customer ID in the search box below the search child customer profile caption as shown in the figure. Then, click on the view button and the child customer profile is displayed. 
To update the child profile, click on the Edit button and make the required changes, and then click the Submit button. Referral Requests Creating a referral request Click on the Referrals button on the left pane. From the drop-down list which appears, click on the Referrals option. The Referral Requests page will appear. There will be four tabs on the Referral Requests page which are Referrals in Process All the new referral requests will be listed under this tab. Referral History All service referral requests will be listed under this tab. Exception Requests a list of all the exception requests will be listed under this tab. Create Referral. Click on the tab to create a new referral request. Creating a referral request. Now click on the Create Referral tab. Then, the Create Referral text box will appear as follows. Then, enter the customer ID of the client and click on the Create button. The referral request for the customer will be created. Creating a referral request. When you click on the Create button, the referral request is created for the customer and the referral success page appears displaying the customer's name, referral request ID, referring worker CCA referee ID, referring worker's name. The page also gives a brief description of the referral program along with stating the steps on how to become a partner agency of CCA. The page also gives a list of the clothing the referral customer can avail at CCA store, along with contact details. This page can be printed for reference by the user by clicking on the print button. Creating a referral request. Creating child referral. A child referral cannot be created separately. It is created at the time of creating a referral for the parent. Now, a referral request for all the children of the referral customer will be created automatically by the system and a success message will be displayed along with the name of the child when the user clicks on the button. Exceptions. Referral service offers up to 32 pieces of clothing or three full clothing sets of clothing once every three months or season, but the client can be referred again if Exceptional referral requests. Reasons. Fire accident, stolen clothing, lost clothing, other. Exception mechanism. The exception mechanism has been designed in such a way so that abuse of the system is prevented, genuine reasons for exception are accepted, and the referral requests approved. Exceptional referral requests. Exception mechanism. When a worker tries to create a second referral request for a customer within the same season, the system checks whether a referral request already exists for the same season. And if it exists, then it will show a notification whether the worker wants to create an exception. Updating profile information. A user can update his or her profile information by like name, contact details, as well as password. To update the details, click on My Profile button on the top left corner and then click on the View Profile button. Now the information about the user will be displayed. Make the necessary changes and click on the Update button to update the details. Thank you. Please contact us at 807-474-3583 or email at admin at clothingassistance.com if you have any questions.